According to records, this was a youth correctional facility until 1962, when the estate was overtaken by an obscure Soviet research fund, the Institute for Human Betterment. Looks deserted. The place was abandoned after a fire in 89. Then, only a few weeks ago, it was acquired by an anonymous investor using cryptocurrency. It has to be Lucas Gray. He's here. Be careful, 47. The breadcrumbs are almost too easy to follow. It could be a trap. Not a trap. An invitation. way 47 and even now you don't remember this place this was our prison where father trained us shaped us into killers for providence uh, you don't remember they ripped it out of you wiped it away but i do i remember everything You're a terrorist with nothing to lose. You'd say anything. I know it's difficult. You never miss your mark or question your function, but we made a pact, you and I. Do this. We both lose. There was an incident. That boy, he died. He lived. Because of you. Don't you remember his name? You know this. Deep down, you know. What was his name? Subject 6. Your name is Subject 6. And what is our purpose? To take them all down. tear it all down. The Institute. Providence. Everyone who'd ever hurt us. We failed. The partners grew paranoid, made sure that Ortmeier's children would never challenge them again. I'm the only one who got away unchanged. The only one left who remembers. Ortmeier was Providence. Everything he did to us, everything he made us do, it all leads back to them. I'm breaking more rules than I care to count, Mr. Gray. What's your play? The partners hide behind a cloak of anonymity. Only one man knows their true identities. Your client, the top controller, the one they call the Constant. He is the key. <laughs> but he is untraceable. So what am I missing? A man would come to the Institute. A man with a Providence pin. The first constant. If we find him, if he... Gentlemen, let's go over the plan. The first constant is none other than Janus, the legendary Cold War spy master. 
a KGB senior officer and head of the 6th Column Special Branch at Lubienka, Janus is a certified genius and expert of counterintelligence. He retired from the KGB in 1988 when he fell out of favor with the Kremlin and defected to the US. Shortly after, the Soviet Union collapsed. Now, it is unclear when Janus stepped down as the constant, but since 2004, he has been a resident of a quiet community in suburban Vermont. Mr. Gray. Right. So here's the catch. As an elite KGB agent, Janus was trained to withstand interrogation and torture. No amount of... Whittleton Creek, Vermont. On the surface, a picture-perfect suburban dream. Wide roads, golden maple trees, and verdant lawns. Most residents here are white-collar professionals, ranging from university staff to government employees. Most, but not all. Janus's unpresuming home is protected by a host of bodyguards, and intel shows that the fragile former constant rarely leaves the property. Nolan Cassidy, on the other hand, roams the neighborhood streets. A recent arrival, the dutiful Providence Herald is busy making threat assessments and settling in with his security team. Now remember, this is about more than just revenge. Janus is the key to bring down Providence. So get in there and find us a lead. Good luck, 47. Forty-seven, I have marked your map with several points of interest. We're running this mission with very little upfront intel, but these locations could provide clues to help you obtain the information we need. Good luck. recording of some sort. The note mentions another house. Perhaps Cassidy is using one of the vacant buildings as a base of operations, 47. Did you review all the mail going out from Janus's house yet? No. I got sidetracked by all the activity. You gotta be kidding me. Huh? So now that's there, you're feeling better. No, I got sidetracked by all the activity surrounding that politician who came to visit. Mm. 
Well, I've got another letter that needs to be looked at before we allow it through. Cassidy made it clear that we'll have no leaks coming from here. I'll put it in the pile when I have time. Got it. So Cassidy withholds Janus's outgoing mail. He might have written something considered confidential in the past. Might be worth a shot. looks to be a gun enthusiast. The room looks like it's outfitted with a lot of security and alarms. I'd suggest you put that away. A letter from Janus to someone called Zoe. It looks like a draft and is full of explicit descriptions of how unhappy Janus is with Zoe and his sister having been appointed chairwomen of the Ark Society. Huh. I've heard that name before. This is a good find, 47. That is Nolan Cassidy, former Secret Service agent and current Providence Herald. Cassidy is assigned to protect Janus. Capable of playing the tapes as well. Why not just keep them here? What? Risk the owners mm. of this house suddenly coming 
Cassidy is certainly keeping a close watch on James. I'm willing to bet those surveillance tapes hold interesting information. Excellent 47. This recording confirms that Janus is planning to meet with the Constant. This is just the sort of thing we're looking for. Hey, buddy, you're way past where you're allowed. Stop right there. No, hey, arsehole, you need to... That's right, keep your hands where I can see them. Nice and easy now. We're taking you into custody. You shouldn't have messed with me! not an ordinary resident of Whittleton Creek, 47. This must be one of Cassidy's men working undercover. I suggest you keep an eye out for more of them. like to come out to the stand and join us, giving away all these what? No way. Jesus! Shit! Help me! I know. But this 
fatty guy is driving me crazy. Every time he sees me, he comes out and wants to talk. And the problem is he just won't shut up. Always ranting about that damn lawsuit against Janus and waving piles of paper at me. As if I give a rat's ass about them. Problems. Let the judge sort it out. What do I want? A lawsuit want, uh, between Janus and a local kind of resident. Me out. It might be just what we're looking for. Batty lives in number 432. Alright, Doc, sorry. I'm just stressing out here, okay? Please, do what you can, alright? Yeah, I'll talk to you. Someone has to teach this guy a lesson. He's serious, bro. Janus is apparently engaged in a civil lawsuit with another resident of Whittleton Creek. James Batty, the plaintiff, wants Janus to stop his annual landing of a helicopter near the local creek. Batty claims it interrupts the nesting birds and a species of frog that has been declared endangered. It must be a very important trip given his poor health. Good work, 47. Anyway. We now know Janus is meeting with the Constant at an event related to the Arts Society. And we have an approximate date as well. I think that's all we're going to get. We're close to the finish line. It's time to end this. Janus, Cold War hey, Spymaster Trespass and the First Providence shot. Constant. Follow me now. I wonder how much Sir. he remembers. How little he cares. Did I? Christ's sake. Command, we've got a casualty. Proceeding with caution. Excuse me? Hmm.
And that is Nolan Cassidy taken care of. Both targets are confirmed killed. All that remains now is to find the information we came for, and then get out of here. All mission objectives are completed. 47, once you've left Whittleton Creek, I will notify Pro Providence of our discovery. In the meantime, we'll go over the clues you found. Once we've located the constant, we'll make our final move. You make it sound so easy.